Hello for the book questers, it is I, Aaron the book quester, to introduce you to this almighty book, The Secret Keepers, by Trenton Lee Stewart. Is knowing a secret a gift or a curse? This book is about at least a very, very normal day named, normal boy named Ruben, at least. Until he had climbed that stupid alley. So one day, Reuben was a very lonely boy, and he spends much of his free time looking around the town, looking for hiding places, hiding holes, little snug places that you can hide. And he liked to eavesdrop on people and play, kind of play like that he was a spy or something like that. And it was kind of awesome for him. And he saw an alley. And the alley was very, very narrow. Uh, narrow enough so she could climb. By that, I mean like this. Stuck between two walls with your hands on the... With your legs on the other wall and your hands on the, uh, the, the next wall. And he sk managed to... Managed to go up and up and up. Almost to a ledge. And there, there, and by then she was very, very tired, and he could not see any way to go down. He went up the ledge, sure, and then he found a leather strap. And he tugged on the leather strap, the concrete gave away, and underneath it, what was underneath it? And in, it, was, it, was, it was connected to a box. In the box was an exquisite, was an exquisite watch, a perfect round spear made out of a metal that could not be identified. It was beautiful, it was perfect, and as Ruben will soon discover, absolutely genius and also very, very addictive. Reuben goes out and he and she she meets the he meets the wise Mrs. Gunnivave and there she's like she says that his watch is looked by the smoke the terrible sounding man who rules New Umbra like his little kingdom New Umbra is the name of the city that Reuben lives in mind you and so and so, and, and the smoke cannot just want it for good reason. Because the smoke is very villainous and evil. And, as we're saying, the good old watch. So he wanted to find out what, 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 and then one day he found out the secret of the watch. It could make a person invisible. And then his adventures followed. He told his mom, who was starting to have money troubles, that number one, he was going on a sleepover, and she's like, "Yes," because her her child is very shy and almost never had a true friend. And then she she met he met he got on a train, and he went to the a lighthouse. Point to William Light. And the the name of the port that was written on the in the in, on the watcher's books. And there he meets he meets Penny and Jack and the whole family. They have been waiting for this to arise, for the special thing to arrive for a very, very, very long time. And, and with fearless Penny and the mighty Jack, her brother, can Reuben use the power of the watch to, to uncover, to defeat this very evil and miraculous smoke? Well, it, you have to read on and on. And as I did not expect, it is a quite a long and delicious read. And 
any person deserves to read this absolutely thrill ride of a mystery. And like, away, you bookquester, or in the bookquester.